I mean, what we're talking about here is like, you know, custom fitting. Custom yeah. fitting for, for for what works for you. Uh, this is Tommy Fleetwood's golf club. Oh, okay. Uh, I brought it out earlier for Sierra, and literally she couldn't she couldn't spin it. She spun it like 900 RPMs. Okay. Um, and and it, we, what we're trying to get at is like the importance of being custom fit, right? For sure. Do you um do you remember the first custom fitting that you had or? Uh, yeah, like uh, six seven years ago. Yeah. It was actually uh, a tailor-made set. Yeah. Aero burner, I think okay. that's what it was. Yeah. And did it make a difference? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It was like the first time that my, the clubs were working with me and I didn't like have to adjust or do anything Yeah. to make the ball go. So talking like um, people getting into the game, right? So mm -hmm. there's this, this, this year, a year like no other, uh, the the participants the participation rate in in golf has gone through the roof. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot more people starting the game. Both you know every demographic, women and men. And um, what do you think the importance is of these people getting custom fit? Well, I feel like if the, you're not using the right clubs, you're going to hit it offline on the golf course, and it's going to make you miserable. And then you probably don't want to play. Yeah. So if you get fitted with a good club, that's going to help you hit it, you're going to play better golf and you're going to enjoy it more and then you want to get better and better and you get the, the bug. Yeah, exactly. And I think as as a good golfer, let's say if I were to hit her clubs, I could maybe try to make them work. Of course, they're not going to be the exact same as mine, but I think we have the skill to make it happen. Yeah. But for an amateur golfer, somebody who's just starting, mm -hmm. if they go and try to hit hers, like they will never want to play golf again. I want you to give Tommy's club, and I want you to tell me what, what's different about that compared to yours. That'll be interesting. We, we, this is like having used to you are pretty strong. It, it's yeah. it's interesting to see how you you kind of get the, the grip feels work. different. Yeah, <laughs> I used to play with these grips. I did. They feel slippier. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hook that. <laughs> is there a different kick point in his? Yeah. Yeah. Is so, it I mean, it's, 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 it's a, a heavy, it's, it's completely different it's, fitted spec to, yeah. to you. It feels like a, it feels like the, the lower kick point. Yeah. Is that? And, and it's like, it's like that, that, that's a shot that you would never hit with, with your, with, with our, her clubs. Yeah, with a proper fit club for us. Yeah. It's a bit better. I like that bull flight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get you but to get yours. Did you now. have to like adapt a little bit for it? Or you just I kinda... just timed it a bit differently on the way down. Right? Like so, yeah. that's I think what I was saying. Like she knows how to time it differently and like we got a better result. Like I don't think your regular amateur would be able to do that. Could time it differently. So I think that's why it's so important to get a fit. Absolutely. For. It's it's like But then also like, you... for us, like I don't wanna be having to think about timing my club when I'm Exactly, Trying playing at the highest it. level, yeah. right? So having a club that works with I, you. I, I kind of like the feel of this club. I love that. I'm <laughs> like, yeah. what shaft I is that? It it's an him. X, it's a 70 gram X. It's really heavy, really it's strong. Heavy. I mean, it's Rory, yeah. Rory played this for a long time. I quite, it and, has and a nice feel, feel to I it. I liked it. I mean, both of mine were good. <laughs> See, I, I like a left miss. I hate a right miss. I'm yeah. weird. I'm the other way around. I so, so when you're going to a fitting, that's definitely something that's important to you. So you would say to the fitter, I prefer to miss the ball on yeah. this side. Don't give me something that goes right. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Like, um, I, I'm, yeah, I'm just, I hate the right shot. I just, if it's going left, I know what to do. If it's going right, I'm like, what, what have I got to do? <laughs> what a difference. Yeah. <laughs> And that's that's what I say, right? When you when you talk about which one did you like the ball flight? This one. Oh yeah, that one. Yeah. I, I like mean that that's probably gone twenty yards longer. Yeah. Through yeah. the air at least. Which I mean, you'd prefer that yeah, for sure. Of that's yeah. What we want. Um, yeah. So so you know I, I've been putting golf clubs for nearly fifteen years now, and uh, what's what I think is important for people to know is like everybody's different, right? So, you, for a fitter, a fitter's got to find out what's important to the person you're fitting. Mm -hmm. So that might be someone who's a beginner and they just want to get the ball in the air. Mm -hmm. There's equipment that can help you do that. And if that's very important to you, then you know, yeah. th th that's, you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to tell you how to play golf. You, mm -hmm. you know how to play golf, but I'm going to ask you the right questions 
find out what's important to you yeah. and then try and execute that. Uh, you know, whether, whether if somebody practices and somebody has a lot of lessons, you know, you might want to know that as a fitter, right? Because, yeah. because then you're not going to fit them for kind of what they're doing wrong. You're going to kind of help their, help their technique get better. Get better, yeah. This match is perfect with the new head. I know. Yeah. It looks good. <laughs> that, that might be important too, making sure you get it's, the right colors. I mean, we were talking about it earlier this morning. Like, for me, it is. Like, the way the club looks and how it sets. Can I just have a look at the... Yeah. You have it quite long, do you? Uh, yeah. yeah, you do. Yeah, so, I mean, you talk about length, you talk about loft, lie, loft, Does, does, does length goal. help you hit it further? I mean, it could do, in theory, yeah. if, if, you, if you're hitting it out the middle, but if you, if you miss the middle... That's nice. Ooh. Very good. Go That's on, give it a give Tommy's That's... driver bike. I'm keeping yours, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> they can't find them shafts. I feel good. <laughs> They, they don't make them no more, do they? No, no, it's an old, you know, and that's... So, that's so, what, so what shaft would they make? What, like, is there like a new of one of them? Yeah, there'd be a new version a new of the new, new, new colours, new No, marketing. this looks what, perfect <laughs> with, with this driver. What's the difference between my driver and her shaft of the driver? The, this one's a little more stiffer in the tip section. Uh -huh. I don't know how, I, how, which one is? This one? Yours. Yours. I don't know how I feel with it being so long. How, does that feel very long? Very long. Feels like I'm going to hit it really offline. And high. <laughs> so, so if you look at like... It feels like it moves more. So, so give me these, these yeah. two golf clubs. So when you look at like from a fitting standpoint, this club's more upright yeah. than this one. Oh yeah. Uh, this one's one notch towards the lower setting, yeah. but it's a 10-5 head. This notch is, is on the upright side, yeah. also towards the lower setting. So there's probably about two degrees loft difference yeah. between hmm. these two clubs, which is why Charlie hit it high so, yeah. and, and yours and came out like better... quite a flat So do note. I actually hit it a bit, quite a bit higher than, would you, would you well, say? Well, it would be how you deliver the golf club. The so golf so, club, so yeah. let's, say, let's, say, let's say you launch the ball at Ten and a half degrees and spin at two thousand five hundred, yeah. and you do the, exactly the same. How you get there is up to you. Yeah. We've, and if that's optimal launch conditions, then we're going to fit your golf clubs for it to yeah. try and get that to happen. Hmm. Got yeah. I quite like, like this. <laughs> Which club in the bag do you practice with the most? Uh, if I'm like doing something technical, it's like eight or six. Yeah. Um, Do you hit many drivers? Like, I never hit drivers. No, and I, always get I don't hit drivers. Like, I, don't hate, I just find it the most boring club in the bag. I honestly just... It just goes high and straight and far. Yeah, I feel like... You, but I feel like... I couldn't practice for long if I had to hit a lot of drivers. I'd be wore out. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm wore out after a fitting. I don't hit a lot of balls, to be fair. I, yeah. think, I think it's like four... Let's see you hit this, Maria. That's pretty good. 57, 273, 2400. Hit yours now. Close to that. What, what, what did that go? So what, what's important to you when, when, you, when you, you, you get fitted for a driver? Well, I want to see some consistency with, like, I don't really look at the good balls as much because mm -hmm. I think the good balls are always going to be similar. Yeah. It's more of the misses. I want to see that it's either always to the right or always to the left, yeah. or at least the high percentage either way. Um, so for me, it's more looking at the bad shots than it is looking at the good shots. Cause so, so from a fitting standpoint, you're trying to make your bad shots better, better more consistent, Because I, I know my good shots are good. I yeah. know I can do that. It's just more of whenever I don't do that, I want to be able to steal. And I play. think that, that's good advice for people at any standard of golf, right? Because, you know, everybody's the the the, the key thing yeah. about getting better scores and lowering your scores is 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 the is the quality of your bad shots, right? I, yeah, that's I think the biggest thing. Like for me, when I moved from amateur golf to professional, like from people who had been on tour for longer than I had. They don't hit it better than me. They just miss it better than me. Yeah. You know, yeah. so I yeah. think that's like the biggest thing of what is the difference between professionals and amateurs is that we are just smarter 
most times. <laughs> <laughs> at golf. And at golf, yeah, yeah, we're talking about golf. Yeah. And we miss it better. We miss yeah. it in places where you know you can get it up and down. We miss it in places where you can hit a decent recovery shot. Of course, you're going to have the odd one where it just goes yeah. where you don't want it to go. Of but course. for the most part, I think our misses are better. So then the good shots are going to come, both for amateurs and for us. But I think it's all about the bad shots, just making them better. Like that one wasn't super solid and it was good. See, like it's... See, that's interesting because like, so, so you, you've now yeah. hit your driver and Charlie's driver and your driver for you is three miles faster on ball speed. Yeah. Which, uh, you know, at the right ball like that, Yeah, I could have so guessed that that was going to... It was more spinnier and... Yeah. Yours. Does she hits it, swings it faster than me, doesn't she? Mm. No, I would say similar, but it's, 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 like, it's not to say that the, that the strongest person has to use the strongest shafts. It's mm -hmm. all about how you deliver the golf club. Mm -hmm. And you're never going to find that out unless you go into yeah. a fitting center and get tested. Is it good? So what's it to do you with know, rhythm Get though? tested, see what works for you. Yeah. It's like, if you don't want to, Charlie, if you don't want to miss it right. <laughs> That's the shot I hate. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't want to miss it right, then, and then somebody gives you something which is too strong for you. and, and Then you're and of you course going to miss it right. Miss it right. Yeah. Fitting, right? So you've yeah. got to take that into account. Yeah. 